Governor Abbott Friday reassured Texans with the reminder we've been in situations like this before. We made it through SARS, we made it through Ebola, we made it through H1N1, and we're going to make it through this together as well. He also updated Texans on the state's testing capabilities. Texas public health labs have the capacity to test 273 people per day currently. Next week, CPL will be able to test several thousand per week. And Abbott announced the state's first drive through testing facility in San Antonio. It will initially be for first responders, healthcare workers, operators of critical infrastructure and key resources, and certain high-risk patients. The governor said more could open in Houston, Dallas, and Austin over the next few weeks. Meanwhile, he's directing state agencies to accommodate telework options and urging Texans to stay calm. There's absolutely no need to go out and stockpile supplies. This isn't a type of situation like what we see uh, with an oncoming hurricane. While it may be a new virus, novel if you will, it's the same people, policies, and procedures that we have used for decades to serve and protect Texans. The governor also explains the disaster declaration allows the attorney general to pursue price gouging prosecution. The attorney general are releasing a statement that their office will be working aggressively to prevent scams and are ready to prosecute any price gouger who takes advantage of the situation. If you believe you are a victim of price gouging, report it to the toll-free complaint line or file online at the Texas Attorney General.gov.